This is a short introduction for Lab 7 to show you how to access some of the simulations. Now in Blackboard, you'll want to go to your assignments and course content and then find the Lab 7 folder. Now the instructor view will look a little bit different than what you'll see in the student view, but you'll want to head and go on down to these simulations. Notice that there are information here that mentions which part of the lab you need to use each simulation for and mentions that you'll need to allow flash on several of these. So we're going to start here with this first one, the Sun-Earth-Moon simulator. And I'm currently working with a Firefox web browser. When you pull it up, it has this thing that you have to run Adobe Flash. Now when I click on that, it's going to ask me if I want to allow it, which I do, and then it brings up the simulation. If it doesn't have that allow or it tells you you don't have Flash installed, you can try to install it that, or you can come over here, well, install Google Chrome as another browser option. So now I'm in a Google Chrome browser. When I come in here and click on the Sun Earth Moon Simulator, there's just a blank space. It doesn't tell you that you have to allow Flash, but that's what you have to do. It's a little bit hidden in the Google Chrome browser. What you need to do is you need to come up to the little symbol which is next to the website address to view the site information. And you want to go to Site Settings. That's going to open up another term. And when you open up that tab, you're going to look down the list of permissions until you find Flash. And you'll notice that it's blocked by default. We want to go ahead and click Allow. Now we have to go back to our first web browser tab and you notice that now it says reload. When I click on the reload, it should bring up flash. Now notice it now says block default, so I'm going to go ahead and click allow, reload, and now you can see your simulation. If you go out of the website and come back in, you may again need to click on this and allow flash. If you don't see the flash allow here, again go back to the site settings, find flash, then go back to your browser, and if necessary again allow it up here. That will allow you to use that. Now luckily our Seasons Interactive does not have flash on it. But when you first get there, you'll need to continue to the interactive to actually get there. The last simulation is our Eclipse Shadow Simulator. And in Chrome, it's already going to allow this for me because it's on the same website as my first one. If I come back over here to Firefox and I try to open up the Eclipse Shadow Simulator, again, it's already done that. If this was the first one you had opened, it would again ask you to allow the Flash player. But since both this one and our Sun Earth Moon, which may be called the Lunar Phase Simulator, are on the same website, it allows it for both of them. If you have any questions about allowing Flash to be able to open up these simulations, please contact me as soon as possible so I can help walk you through the process.